Hello and welcome back to New Year, New Game. This is where I attempt to play 365 games from my Steam library that I have never played before. This is game 210, Killer is Dead, Nightmare Edition. Now I am late to the game, or any game that's actually made by a game developer named Saru. 51 and I recently discovered this individual through watching the completionist on YouTube he spoke very highly of this individual in the games that he makes he's known for making no more hero lollipop chainsaw and uh, killer seven which we played earlier in the series as well uh, I have dabbled with Lollipop Chainsaw on 360. We just got a small taste of Killer7 earlier this year. And I have purchased No More Hero 1 and 2 on my Nintendo Switch digitally. But I have not gotten around to playing them yet. But looking at the review with Gerard who was playing No More Hero 3. It looks like a really fun game. It's got a lot of silliness to it. Uh, the game developer and himself, he was a part of that video as well. And he seems like a really fun person. And just, I think that his games would be really fun to play. And so when I was going through my library and I was picking out different types of games, I know that I had some older games that came out. Uh, like for this one, I think was, God, 2014, 15? that this game came out and so I wanted to grab some of those and then finding out that this is a part of one of Sadu's games earlier games I was like oh well this is great I gotta give it a try and I even think that the game probably came out earlier than that but because this is Nightmare Edition it was released later on um, I did not look up when this game actually came out and I'm sure it was a console game before it was a PC game so Without further ado, let's get in the game. Episode 3, A Woman of Pain. Uh, real quick before we continue doing that, though. Pull up my options, but it doesn't look like it lets me. Can't even like go back to the main screen. Maybe when I'm in the mission. A woman of pain, client Robert. Status new mission. Target information is Alice. She's a female, 5'7", age 21, and is French. Let's go. Starts today. Mika, get up. Time to go. Get dressed. It's time to go to the office. What? We passed the test? I passed the test. What about me? Failed, obviously. Huh? I was afraid of that. I'm a loser. <laughs> <laughs> If you're gonna throw a tantrum, do it later. I've got work to do right now. Just try harder next time. You know I'm gonna need an assistant. Really? Yes, now let's get ready. Pronto. I'll do my best! Morning. Mondo reporting for work. I'll be starting here today. I'm his assistant. I'll be helping him out! <laughs> That's nice, newbie. But you've already got the job. 
Save it for later. All right, you two, listen up. We're the country's first line of defense. We operate solely on tax dollars, so we can't afford to waste a single moment. From now on, every fiber of your being exists to serve the state. Am I clear? Yeah, I think so. I understand! So, who's our client? Good. He should be here any second. I already am. <laughs> Sitting here the whole I'm time. I'm Robert, the artist. So to summarize, you're living next to a monster. Is that right? Monster? So, you're suggesting that this creature is what's responsible for all the recent disappearances? That's only speculation, of course. Speculation? Truth is often found buried deep within speculation. In fact, some monsters can only be uncovered through speculation. Chief, please calm down. <laughs> yeah, I got a little ahead of myself there. Well, that's not all. You hear children scream in terror every single night, and the window is spattered with blood. And it's only natural to assume that you're living next door to some kind of demon or a monster. And this drawing came straight from our client. It's gotta be the real deal. So, Mondo, do you have it all? Yeah, I've got it covered. All right, then. After careful consideration, we decided to take on your case. However, I do need to inform you that the function of this office is execution. You got any problem with that? Execution? Yeah. Well, this is a monster. It's a monster. Right, a monster. We kill monsters! <clears throat> that okay with you? Yes. Fine. Now we need the $10,000 up front for our services. What? Isn't the state supposed to pay for the execution? The execution, yes. But cleanup of the body parts and gore is not cheap. Vivi, why don't you just calculate the expenses at the end? Chief, not again. A fitting task for our newest employee. Wouldn't you agree, Mondo? <laughs> Please check back with our office in one week, and we'll give you a status report on our progress. Now, if you could please sign on the line. But of course, we won't keep you waiting an entire week. Thank you very much. Hmm, you gonna slay a monster? That's just a loading screen? It is. It's awfully quiet. I don't hear any screams. It's a quiet neighborhood. But something smells fishy. Literally. What a horrible odor. Like something's rotting. Will you two be all right? We'll be fine. Fine and dandy! Give us a call if things get out of hand. We'll send back up right away. Thanks. The job? Killer is dead. Now where's our client? Do we just go into his house? Excuse me, sir.
Please, I need help. You are... It's my sister. Please help her. My older sister. She... she's lost it. What's her name? Alice. Where is she right now? A man... Please help Alice. I'm begging you. Where is Alice right now? She was tricked by a scary-looking man. That's why I'm frightened. You have to trust me. My name's Mondo. What's your name? Elisa. She looks like Alice from Alice in Wonderland. Hmm. Wearing the uh, box on her head now. <laughs> oh, look at this thing. You said right away. How long are you gonna make me wait? Forget about work and just come see me. I have something special for you. door. Now we're on the ceiling. Just hack your way through the weak one. <laughs> At times, it's necessary to block your enemy's attack. But keep in mind that there are certain powerful attacks that can't be blocked, so keep on your toes. <laughs> No matter how powerful an attack, if you can dodge it, it's meaningless. <laughs> Penetrate the enemy's guard, then watch for an opening and deliver the fatal blow. Uh, guard break. You hold Y, release for guard crush. <laughs> 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 little cool stance thing there at the end. Disgusting. Yeah, it looks like the door's opened. <laughs> do we give her the cupcake? They do. Thank you. Is that woman? That's uh, stuck on me. It's a lady up there, too. So we just go through the next door. It looks like outdoors inside the room. What a strange place. Look at this guy. <laughs> Be careful. As long as his head is attached to his body, he's immortal. You have to cut it off. How do you do that? Once you stun an enemy, use the adrenaline burst. This uses blood to cut an enemy in two. Right trigger an X adrenaline burst. Now's your chance. Finish it! And now we got flowers. Thank you.
Hey, Mika. Where did you get in from? Sir! You came just in time! This lamp is very strange. Every time I put it out, it keeps relighting. Weird. You haven't answered my question. Quit playing around and get to work. We need to find Alice. Aye, aye, sir! But what she said also bothers me. What? Is that lamp bothering you? If you can't reach something, your left arm might come in handy. But just be careful about using too much blood. Mondo's left arm, Muscleback, operates on blood absorbed from defeating enemies. Muscleback secret, you can disguise your hand as a human one to crack fingerprint codes. Uh, Sub-weapon mode, Muscleback changes into sub-weapons, use Mondo's vision to RC enemies. Uh, L2, ready your sub-weapon, Mondo Vision, L2, aim, L2, R, shoot, okay. Hmm. And just shoot it then. Final judgment, perform combo streaks to pass judgment on the wires. Drop items change depending on the selection, enforcement kill, carnage kill, punishment kill, assassin kill. Using moon crystals, Mondo's acquire new skills. Check your status when you gather moon crystals. You can select open the upgrade menu by selecting stats and upgrades in the office or in the pause menu. Let's see, stats and upgrades. So we can get piercing katana. Attack instantly after a break dash and pierce enemies' weak spots. High mobility, move short distances very quickly. Uh, restore health using blood. I think I'm gonna do that. Alright, let's continue. house you see anyone else here I met your younger sister Elisa Elisa that girl is she still hanging around she was quite worried about you lies you're right that is a lie 
All I sense in this house is your stench. It only has your color. I've met you before. Mondo. Thank you. You are the first and the last man to have come this far. I will take away all of your pain. I'll set you free. Yes. It hurts. It hurts. Alice, what's wrong? Where does it hurt? It's my back. For how long? A year. I took a vacation to the moon, and ever since I returned, it hurts. Moon? Did you see anyone there? Yes. It hurts. It hurts. Mondo, please. Help me. Who did you see on the moon? A scary... Man. His name. I need his name. I remember. David! Ah, oh, so that's the name of the man on the moon. It's gone. I want to see David. I can see why that would hurt. Mondo, am I a tortured soul? Mm -hmm. Look at this thing. Uh, block when the enemy flashes red to perform a just guard. Even the strongest enemies are defenseless when they attack. X only on easy. Dodge and attack at the last moment to perform a dodge burst, then press X to perform a burst rush. Under attack, then mash X to do burst rush, which we were doing earlier today. <laughs> Oh, I probably gotta use this. Now that hurt.
Why are you not? Come on. Did I not do it right? Now we did. Oh ho! Don't know what part that came out of. Oh! Spitting out little things. Just got phased. That was new. Polar is dead. Release. Glad I picked up that heal skill. Poor Alice. We're so sorry. Rest in peace inside this house of candy. Boss, job's complete. Good work. In fact, great work from a newbie. Here is the promised object. Ooh, an object. Thank you. <laughs> Alice, we made it last. So, it was you all along. Um, did you know her? Yes. This is the woman who killed me. Do not be deceived by the story of the moon. This woman is a natural born killer. Now my death has been avenged. I greatly appreciate your help. Which means no payment, you've been ghosted. Should have got it up front. He's gone. Vanished. <laughs> The joke's on us. How are we supposed to get paid, Chief? I guess we'll just build the state. <laughs> Took about nine minutes. Four minutes of those was execution time. Alice bug me. The bee again. Uh, 
Alright. Unless there's a cutscene here, there is not. Betty's Gigolo mission unlocked. Seductive vampire. Natalie's Gigolo mission unlocked. Strong, hot headed girl. You can play Gigolo in challenge missions as many times as you want. The head icon indicates an execution request at the office. A new item arrived at the gift shop. Use your execution rewards to buy presents for beauties. Each time you buy a gift, the price goes up. When you make a beauty yours by giving her presents, she may give you the latest weapons in return. Added nightmare mode difficulty. Thanks. Uh, okay. So that is going to do it for me for Killer is Dead. This is a fun game. I think if I had this game earlier on consoles, I would enjoy playing this game. This would be, like, right up the type of games that I was playing during that time. It's a hack and slash. It kind of reminds me a bit of Devil May Cry. It's not as fast-paced and doesn't seem like the combos are there. But when it comes to, like, the action and fighting and things like that... That's kind of where it just reminds me of, is, is that particular type of game. Hack and slash, action packed, uh, using different types of upgrades to increase your character to make them stronger. I am all for that. I can only imagine what this game would be like on harder difficulties as well. Now they have Nightmare Edition added to it as well. Uh, using the, I mean, getting used to like the blocking and the dodge and things like that, I think would be awesome. This would uh, be a really fun game to play through and do like a complete story playthrough, I think is uh, what I would be aiming for. But yeah, I give it a big old thumbs up and I'll be adding it to the 2023 would play again list. If this is something that you would like to see a series played here on my channel, just leave a comment below that you'd like to and I'll consider it. Anyways, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next game. Goodbye.